Yo, what's going on YouTube? It's your boy YCB man. Uh, today we have a topic video. Today's topic video, we are actually talking about Brittany Renner. I actually talked about this in my previous live stream, but the footage got corrupted and I can't download it from YouTube for some reason, but it's okay. I'm gonna make a separate video on it um, because I, I do wanna talk about this. Uh, we are talking about Brittany Renner and how she recently converted to Islam. Yeah, anyway, um, but before we get into it, please do me a favor. Do not forget to share, like, and subscribe. It really helps out with the channel. Let's me know that you are rocking with the content. And while you are at it, please do me a favor and follow me on all of my social media platforms at WatchTV94. That is at WatchTV94. Follow me on Twitch at twitch.tv slash Watts underscore TV94. That is twitch.tv slash Watts underscore TV94. And also, join the Discord, man. I will leave a link to that in the description down below. But without further ado, let's talk about Brittany Renner. All right. So, if you don't know who Brittany Renner is, first of all, you're living under a rock. Um, to make a long story short, if I had to class classify her as anything, she is probably the boss of, of IG thoughts, right? She's gotten around in the industry. She's slept around with a, a lot of people. She had a baby by PJ Washington, who is like insanely younger than her. She was a very promiscuous woman, all right? She openly talked about, you know, intercourse and was very okay with showing her body. Um, but she did a complete, she did recently did a complete 180 and she came out in one of her videos uh, wearing a hijab. And I'm just very much confused. So let's, let's see what she has to say. This is the first video that she posted in a hijab and it was just random to me and a lot of other people too because i feel like she didn't even give like warning <laughs> she gave nobody a warning that she even thought about doing this it just seems so totally random first of all honey you know what i've noticed <laughs> in any message i share for the record always applies to myself like i'm not exempt just because i'm sharing it <laughs> so i've noticed that we want to sign your sign mind you we've been getting dreams songs angel numbers that post that came across our feed that just so happened to apply to our situation but we want the sign to be on the billboard in big red letters lit up with glitter and it's almost as if we're waiting for this moment to feel ready you're not going to feel ready for something you've never done that's why you have to get pushed we're, and we're also waiting for us to trust the outside world and the people in it but a bird doesn't trust the branch it lands on. It trusts its wings. And you should do the same. I'm not gonna hold you. Um, what? One fish, two fish, red fish, blue fish, knick-knack, paddywhack, get a dog a bone. Yo, that is one thing that I genuinely cannot stand about Brittany Renner. She's always trying her hardest to be like extremely deep and it comes off as just fake and you just sound like you're rambling when you try to be deep a lot of people can tell that it's not genuine and it just comes off as, as sounding crazy like that's what you sound like that's what i heard when i listened to you just now like what are you talking about that was the third time that was the third time i listened to her ramble in that speech and i still don't know what she's talking about like i i tried say what you will but i genuinely have tried i i don't understand i don't know what the hell she's talking about and honestly the only thing that i was focusing on was she's wearing a hijab where did this where did this come from because i was especially confused because you know if you guys know anything about islam um as a woman you're supposed to cover up and you're supposed to be modest however if we take a closer inspection of her instagram First of all, this picture that is, you know, pinned to her profile is just, she's showing all types of ass. And let's just go down the rest of her profile. Like, ass. 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 Like, just everywhere. Like, very revealing clothing. Like, very much revealing. I'm just, I don't know. Like, don't get me wrong, I know most of this stuff is more than likely up because she has some, like, contractual um, obligations, which I'm pretty sure she did say in the next video that we were going to watch. But, like, how can I say this nicely? It's, 
it's it makes it that much harder to believe you when you still have all of these revealing pictures of yourself like still up it is very and honestly people do not change overnight just a year ago maybe it probably wasn't even a year ago um it was probably this year i don't know chat let me know where she was drunk on a podcast twerking on charleston white and threw water on him okay that wasn't that long ago this is that same person people do not change overnight just because they convert to a different religion i'm sorry can it happen sure is it gonna happen is it happening with britney renner i do not think so at at all i think this is another case of someone who was running away um from their previous persona and in order to do that they're running towards religion which isn't necessarily a bad thing but you are going to have a real tough time being credible and believable especially in this case especially in this case anyway let's let's go to the next video let's see what she has to say so i'm currently cleaning house out with the old and with the new manifesting a new wardrobe inshallah i have no idea how this is gonna look I have contractual obligations, clothes to wear, mm -hmm. posts to do, <laughs> bills that have to be paid, and, um, you know, showing up the best I can, right? Because I know that it's not going to be perfect. I know that people may have a gripe. I mean, my arms are out, right? First of all, it's hot, and then I sweat like a puddle under my armpits. Not an excuse, but looking into Botox under my arms and finding clothes that are more aligned with where I'm headed, even if it's not to the book perfect. That's what this is all about for me, is I'm just gonna show up and give my best, and every day my best gets better. Okay, cool, w whatever. She said, you know, obviously, like I said before, she said that she still has contractual obligations to make, and she's still going to have to wear some sort of clothing. And you know what, from what I've seen online, the Islamic community, the Muslim community, has been very accepting of her very accepting um they're happy that she decided to take on this journey and you know like i said very accepting that's cool but guys this is britney renner that we're talking about here this is britney renner that we're talking about how long how long do you think she's gonna last how long truthfully how long do you guys really think britney renner is going to last She's still the same person. How soon is it going to be before she's twerking on the internet again and being her usual rowdy ratchet self? And I say ratchet because that is the behavior that she has shown previously. And I do not call black women ratchet just because they're black women. I, I'm not Myron from Fresh and Fit. From Fresh and Fit, I do not do that. I call Brittany Renner ratchet because she is ratchet. Like if you saw her previous behavior, you would agree with me. You would most definitely agree with me. I just, it's cool that the Muslim community is very accepting of her. I am not going to believe it. I think she is going to continue being the same person that she has been this entire time. And yeah, I, if we if we are taking bets, I'm going to be generous. And I said she's going to stick with this for, for seven months. I'll say seven months. I said something else on the stream, but I promise you, I know she she was probably going to at least stick with this for seven months, and then afterwards she's going to be done with it, and she's going to become regular old Brittany Renner again. She's going to stop wearing the hijabs. Just seeing her in a in a hijab is just very very much wild, considering who she used to be. But again, this isn't me judging anybody because they want to take a religion seriously. I I actually applaud her. If that's what you want to do. That's what you want to do. That's cool. I, I think being devout to a religion is great. I'm not judging her for that. It's just the person. It, it's the person that makes this entire thing not believable. And I, you know what? I just find it very ironic. I said this on the stream too. I find it very weird how when people essentially want to make a change about themselves or change their image, they run to Islam specifically. Like in the red pill community, it makes sense why they want to run run to like uh you know Islam. It makes so much sense why they want to be Muslim because a lot of these guys just want to have multiple wives, and that sucks to say, but it's it's true. But yeah, I just find that very interesting. But yeah, I don't I don't believe this. I don't believe this. Um, it's just I find it very hard to believe that Brittany Renner is just going to change overnight. 
Uh, I hope she does. I don't want you guys to get misconstrued. I really hope she does. I I pray that I'm wrong, and I hope that she takes this seriously, but I'm giving her seven months. Guys, let me know what you think in the comments down below because I don't think any of this is genuine. It just seems very random, and it just seems like a way to cause more attention to herself. I hate to say it, but it's it's tr that's how I feel. Let me know what you think in the comments down below. Do you agree with anything that I said? Do you disagree? Please let me know in the comments down below. Don't forget to follow me on all of my social media platforms. And follow me on Twitch. Join the Discord. I'll leave a link to that in the description down below. And I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.